In this video, you will learn how to insert secondary axis in a line graph in Microsoft Excel. For example, you can see here I have draw a graph and it has two y axis. First one shows the sale values, while second one shows the profit values. Let's look at this data. You can see here I have three columns. First one shows the month, second one sales, and third one shows the profit. The profit values are in 100, while the sales values are in thousands. If I want to display on same graph, then it is not possible without inserting secondary axis. For example, if I want to draw a graph of this data, go to insert tab and insert a line graph, you can see here it is hardly visible because there is a larger difference between these two values. When there is a significant difference between these two values, then there is a need of secondary axis like this one. So I timely I will delete this one and move to next sheet to start this tutorial. And I am Dr. Tarim Mahmood and you are watching Teaching Junction channel. If this video is helpful for you, then please like this video and subscribe our channel for more informative videos. So without any further delay, let's start this tutorial. Select this data. Go to insert tab. In insert tab, you will find the option of insert combo chart. Click here and select this one, which is the line on secondary axis. Firstly, I will resize it. Secondly, I will uh, click on this chart element option, which is the plus sign. And from here, I will select axis title, click here and uncheck these grid lines, click here. Now this one shows the sale, click here and write sale in formula bar. press enter similarly click here and write profit press enter and this one shows months now click on chart title Put equal sign in formula bar and select this cell which contain title, press enter. Now go to home tab and change your color to black, bold and 16 font size, 18. Now click here, change its color to black bold and 12 now double click on this format painter option and click here to format like this one Next click on this axis values, right click, go to format axis, and change minimum value to 2000. Scroll down, and here you will find the option of tick marks. I want to insert tick marks outside and outside both major and minor. Now go to fill and line option and from here select color black and width 1.5 pt. Similarly select secondary axis, select its color to black 
and width 1.5 pt go to this series option and from here i will select minimum value to 200 and i want to insert tick marks scroll down and in tick mark option select tick marks on outside now similarly click on here and tick marks outside now go to filler line option to select a solid line on x axis Now you can see here we have completed the formatting here. Now I want to change this bar graph into a line graph. Click on any bar, right click, you will find the option of change series chart type. Click on this option. Now here you will find the option of share and here chart type is clustered column. Click on this sign and you will find different option select this line graph option without marker click here then click on ok now you can see here that the line graph is inserted with secondary axis you can change their color as well for example i will click here go to format data series and in fill and line option i can click on this option line option and color i will change it color to this one you can see here that the color is changed if you want to insert a marker on this line you can go to this marker option and from here marker option select build in and you can select the type of marker you can change their color you can insert a border around marker then there are plenty of option and you can adjust the size of marker from this and that's the end of this tutorial you can see here that the markers are inserted here you can change their uh, border or you can change their fill color so that's the end of this tutorial thanks for watching this tutorial goodbye